Hey everyone, we're here at TriggerCon 2017. Unfortunately unarmed because they are wanding and checking bags at the front door, which is a interesting thing at a gun show. But that aside, you should probably contact the organizers and let them know that that's not cool. They don't even let knives in here. Yeah, no knives, anything. It's ridiculous. They almost stopped me for my trauma shears on my bag. So anyway. Well, don't say anything because I was able to get mine in. <laughs> okay, well, we'll, uh, we'll keep that under wraps. This will go up after the show is right, over. Right, yeah. So uh, we're here at the Chris booth. As you, as you guys have probably heard of, you got the Chris Vectors, which are phenomenal. I think they're the most fun full auto to shoot. The cyclic rate is insane. And the way it operates keeps it nice and manageable. Their Sphinx pistols are phenomenal. I honestly think it's the best double action trigger on the market. But one thing that I haven't seen a whole lot of coverage of, or if maybe I haven't been paying attention, but that's their 22 ARs that they're doing. So can you tell us a little bit about the idea behind these and what, what yeah. uh, makes these? Well, what it's still kind of new. That's probably why you haven't heard a lot about it yet. The idea behind our DMK-22 is that we wanted you to be able to do everything to this gun that you would normally do on your AR-15. Okay. So, you know, a lot of the other, you know, 22 ARs on the market, they make concessions here and there. But literally everything that functions on your AR will function on this gun. So the bolt stop, the last round bolt hold open, the forward assist, um, and everything is, is the same size as your AR-15 accessories too. So if you wanted to put your rapid charging handle on there, go for it. If you wanted to put your, your Geisley trigger or some other trigger on there, go for it. You know, it'll all work. That's awesome. Yeah. And as far as the magazines, what kind of magazines are you guys using? So we make these magazines. Okay. So with our magazine, with this little, uh, little tab right there, that's what's gonna give you the last round bolt hold open. Um, but these are compatible with Black Dog bags. Awesome. So if you have already an AR-22 with Black Dog magazines, those magazines will work on here. Perfect. Yeah. So that, that's one of the big concerns when it comes to the 22 ARs or even some other guns yeah. is you'll get proprietary magazines that may work, but they're unobtainium or they're really expensive when you yeah. do get them. Or on the other end of things, they're cheap magazines, but they don't, they don't work. work. Yeah, so exactly. this is that perfect mold between, yeah, they do have their proprietary version, but it will work, it will work with other magazines yeah. that are already out there that a lot of you already have, like say a M&P 2215 or 1522, you probably already have these. Another thing that works on this gun are Ruger 1022 barrels. Really? And so our barrel adapter that's inside of here uh, will accept the Ruger 1022 barrel. So if you already have, or if you have a really awesome like fluted, lightweight barrel or something like that, go ahead and throw it on this gun and it'll, it'll bolt up just fine. So let's say I filed a tax stamp and I have a integrally suppressed 1022 barrel. That'll yeah. fit in here? Yeah. If it fits on a Ruger 1022, it'll, it'll drop on here. Okay. You're not going to do much better than that. If you can get parts compatibility with a 1022, you're never going to have a hard time finding parts for that. That's the idea. Um, and so I shot this for the first time at SHOT Show in, back in January. I shot this yesterday and uh, it feels like you're not shooting a gun. Yeah. I mean, it, it's a very similar weight to your AR-15, so if you want to be able to train with it or train a new shooter on how to work an AR-15, so you have a kid or a significant other who may be a little gun shy, this is a perfect way to introduce them to it. And no noise, very light shooting. It's gonna be a very pleasant introduction into the AR series of rifles. Mm -hmm. Now, probably what I think I was the most impressed by though was the price point. So what, do you know roughly what these are gonna be coming in at? So this is the standard DMK22 carbine. It is gonna MSRP for $599. Okay. Or I'm sorry, $699. $699? Okay. Um, yeah, $699 for the DMK. And then we also have, of course, the LVOA version. You know, we have the license to produce the LVOA rail from Warsport. Uh, that one's gonna be $799. All right, yeah. I'm not gonna lie. This whole look makes my pants a little tight. So uh, some some really cool stuff here. You got the last shot hold open, mags that you can actually find places, yeah. compatibility with 1022 barrels, the look, feel, manipulation, everything of your standard AR-15. So if you're someone who doesn't like to spend a whole lot of money to train with your guns, you can put yeah. set this up just like your go-to AR-15, have the same you know experience and just spend a whole lot less on ammo Fresh now the 22 ammo is actually available and you yeah. can pretty much find it at walmart again yeah so uh really awesome stuff do you know roughly when these are going to be available be here by august September. by august okay yeah. so hopefully within the next few months we're going to see these released but uh i'm definitely anxious to see these get into a bunch of people's hands see how they run but knowing the, the quality that you guys have been putting out before i think uh i think this is probably going to be something that's going to be yeah. good to go so thanks a lot We're for talking excited. to us if people want to find out more where can they look uh chris-usa.com that's k-r-i-s-s-usa.com okay so i'll have the links below in the description check it out if you haven't shot a chris vector go to a range event where they have one it's it will change your uh viewpoint on a lot of things but 
definitely look out for when these come out. Uh, I'll try to stay on top of it and let you guys know once they hit the market. But really awesome stuff here. As always, thanks for watching. That feels a lot like a regular AR. No recoil. Super quiet. I like it. Do you want it? I do. I do. I need this in my life. I like it and I want it. We could do this the easy way or the hard way. <laughs>